Hello guys, it's Andre and today we're gonna take a look at the AK Ham. And with all the AK we have on Breaking Point, the AK-74, the AK-74U, the AK-105, 107. They're all small caliber compared to the AK Ham. And I'm really happy we have at least a 7.62 AK Ham rifle. And uh, talking about it, it's very good because you don't need to go to the best looting areas in order to find this rifle. You can go in uh, the normal military bases and from my experience going in certain military bases makes you find this rifle very often. And before looking at the details of this weapon, let's take a look at this weapon in action against zombies. The first thing we notice about the Heike Ham is that the recoil is not that easy to control. So if you want to shoot somebody from medium to long range distance, you need to make sure you shoot in small bars or either on single fire mode. Said that, the gun is very very loud. That is a big problem, especially for the mod breaking point because having a gun that shoots very loud is going to be many people hearing you. So once you shoot, once you finish the engagement with somebody, you need to make sure you take from the body of the guy that you killed everything that you need and get out as fast as you can because it's very very loud. Another problem I face when using this weapon is that you can put no attachments on this weapon. My friend told me that you can put a Russian scope but I never found the scope and I never tried to put it on the Hake Ham. But you can put the normal scope so you better train with the iron sight and the way I do it I shoot zombies from medium to long range engagements, that's when you really need accuracy with the iron sights. And also I found another problem, the problem is shooting at night with this weapon. The iron sights are so small that sometimes in a low visibility situation it's really hard to be very accurate. Some people say that the Heike Ham is not very good in close quarters, it's not very good in uh, when you go inside the cities. And I also understand that the AK-74 was created to create a balance between the AK-47 and Hakenham and between the MP-40, so something between, mostly for close quarter engagements. But it depends on your playstyle. Personally, I like to shoot through walls, I like to pin people down inside building, make them scared. So I shoot through walls, I shoot through windows to pin them down and take them by surprise. So for me, this is the perfect weapon. And if you know how to handle the recoil, it's as good as a AK-107 and take less time to kill somebody if you hit them. And now let's see this weapon in action against players. The Heike Ham is a rare weapon. You can find it on the military base where you find the other AKs on the green weapon boxes. But the problem is it's not as common as the other AKs. And what I found is that in some military bases on Altis seem to spawn very very often. I'm not gonna reveal the location because yeah, I think the best thing about breaking point is finding new places, finding new spawn points by yourself. 
and you know searching around so look around military bases some military bases in my experience spawn a lot of a case and also we have a 762 ammunition I want to talk about it because right now it's a problem but it's not going to be a problem with the new patch it's going to be released with a new type of a refilling magazine basically if you have a 762 rounds which are not designed for the Hakeham you can't use them you just need to use the Hakeham magazine this is a this is a problem because maybe you have a lot of 762 but you can put the 762 in the Hakeham you just need that magazine with the new update you will be able I'm sure to put the normal 762 into a, a Hakeham magazine so this won't be a problem in the future we have medium to high damage 762 if you hit somebody it's gonna be really bad for them we have a medium recoil and medium weight and no attachments for the weapon personally I love the case guys and I'll tell you this weapon is wonderful the only problem are the iron sight tonight and it's a very loud gun and this might be a problem sometimes you have uh, you know a whole city is coming to you zombies players just because they hear you from very far away so thank you guys for watching and see you on the next video